The school is nearly back in session, and while the teachers and schools are getting ready, administrators say parents should remind their kids how they should act in class and on their bus trip to school. TV6's David Jackson went to Aspen Ridge Elementary for an up-close look at how preparations for the new school year are coming along. The 2017-2018 school year is right around the corner. Our first day of school is the day after Labor Day, which is Tuesday, September 5th. Back to school specials are running at local stores and teachers are already moving into the rooms to get ready for students. And I think that we are ready to roll. Uh, the kids are the easiest part. We open the doors and they'll come in and they'll say, all right, what do you have for us this year? So we're really excited to have them back. After a summer of being able to do construction, schools are putting the finishing touches on their buildings. And we are totally renovating our media center. So we tore it right down to the concrete block and rebuilt it from the ground up. And uh, that should be done at the end of next week. Administrators say parents should remind their kids how to act while riding the bus. Please tell your children to be courteous to the driver and sit down. Just not run around the bus and climb over seats. And uh, treat the bus like a classroom. Bus drivers ask kids to remember when they are close to the road. Always look out for traffic, wait for the signal before they approach the bus or cross the street, and always stay visible to the driver. If you're getting off the bus, take two giant steps if you are crossing in front of the bus so the driver can see you. Wilmer says starting next Wednesday, when the Nice Community School bus drivers meet for the first time, the big yellow buses will start practicing their routes. People should remember when they see the flashing red lights, stay 200 feet back, watch for little siblings and pets along the side of the road, and remember to give some extra time to get to work. Those of you that don't have kids in school, watch out. The day after Labor Day school begins, and you will be late for work sometimes if you're going to rush. In Ishpeming, I'm David Jackson for TV6 News.